hi guys welcome back to the garage so today I am going to do uh, the full spread and this is I guess you could say part of the homework from um, our friend Zach the Tiger's Abyss has started uh, what he calls the Tiger's Bookshelf on Facebook there's a Facebook group called the Tiger's Bookshelf and the first book that we're working through is Rachel Pollock's Tarot Wisdom, which is great. We're really having a good time with it. And Zach goes live once a week so we can discuss uh, what we've learned, what we think about the book, and, and everything like that. So at the end of uh, each chapter, we've noticed there's a spread. And so we're all doing these spreads in various ways. Some are doing them on Facebook. Some are doing them on Instagram. My preference was to do it here on YouTube. I'm going to keep it up on my channel, but I'm also going to upload it to the Facebook group for all our other book clubs uh, to see and share. So here is the full, a full reading. I am using my Hip Chick Tarot because I'm really digging these cards right now. Uh, I have shuffled and cut already, so I, I kept that out. So the full reading uh, from the end of the, the full chapter is seven questions. So here we go. One, how have I been a fool in my life? Child of Earth. So this is the Page of Pentacles. Yeah, um, I like to spend money. <laughs> if you guys haven't noticed, you know, very excited from, you know, starting that working in the, in the world and, um, you know, the world is my oyster. And, um, yeah, so I think uh, I've been a little foolish maybe with my money. <laughs> Question number two, how has it helped me? So how has the fool helped me? Six of feel. So this is the six of cups. And the the fool has just helped me be um, open and kind and more giving. Uh, very much giving. Uh so that's what I think the fool has taught me. I don't only just like do stuff for myself. I like doing things for other people uh, too, just for no apparent reason at all. Just because I love you, I will do things for you. So um, yeah, that's that's how I think the, the fool has helped me. Now, how has the fool hurt me? That's number three. <clears throat> Boss of Earth. Okay, so this, I think, is the Knight of Pentacles. <clears throat> Sometimes, uh, through my life, there, there are time periods where I've not been as kind. I've been rather, you know, I got this, you know, get out of my way, um, you know, um, I don't need any help. Uh, stuff like that. So I think that's kind of hurt me. Uh, that hurt me early on being foolish about not needing help. You know, I have the strength to, to carry the world on my shoulders and I can do whatever I want kind of deal. So I think that's, that's kind of hurt me. Um, question four. Where in my life do I need to be more foolish? The nine of feel. The nine of feel. I am so trying to cut myself some slack from all the things I do. And um, lately, uh, truthfully, I, I have been giving myself more of a break to just not be responsible and, and just to be and, and enjoy. There's been some things going on with the family, as you all know. And so, um, 
it's teaching me to be more foolish in that aspect is to spend more time with with family and um, home and uh, being in that love space right now so yeah okay where question five where will the fool not serve me being foolish in the world <laughs> The fool will not serve me to get ahead, I think. Being foolish. Being, you know, just getting to a point where it's just like, whatever. What the hell? I don't care anymore. I'm just, you know. And I think we all reach times where it's like, you know, I'm tired of adulting. I'm tired of a responsibility. I am just going to go balls to the walls and do whatever the hell I want to do. Oops. Sorry for the nudie bits. I'll cover her up. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I think sometimes being foolish out in the world, being naive and not keeping your eyes open to what's going on can, can uh, cause you can cause you some trouble. You can't go around with blinders on. So... Question six, where do I find the fool outside myself? The eight of feel. Wow, I'm getting a lot of cups here. A lot of cups. The eight of cups. Where do I find myself? New adventures. That's where the fool finds me uh, outside myself. New adventures. Doing things that I have not done before that I wanted to do and, and just taking those chances and those opportunities to to go in a different direction so um, yeah I've been doing some new things lately uh, one of which is tomorrow I'm going to a mala making workshop uh, I've always wanted to make my own mala but I've never had the the guts to actually go to a workshop but I'm going tomorrow so that's what I think about that and then the last question is, what gifts does it bring me? So what gifts does the fool bring me? The fool brings me celebration. Celebration, friends, family, all the good things. So to me, this spread is like, um, <clears throat> I think with the fool, I think I'm doing a really good balancing act. That's what all of these cards mean to me, is that I am doing a great balancing act between being foolish and, and being, uh, you know, responsible and not being too overbearing and enjoying family and not overlooking things that are going on outside the world. and trying new things and celebrating those new things so um yeah this was my full reading i did it i did it all right guys much love go over to the tiger's abyss find yourself the tiger's bookshelf group join up get the book start reading join us with the fun all right guys i'll see you next time